search goes on for three. And we have the health care battle. Uh, it really is at a stalemate in Washington, D.C., as we witnessed all of last month. But outside of the Beltway, people with medical issues, they're struggling to find proper care. And that is the case in Idabel, Oklahoma, where hundreds of people, hey, they started lining up early this morning uh, to find out about different opportunities for care at a mobile clinic. And NBC's Maya Rodriguez is there. Uh, and Maya, I understand you're joined by one of the volunteers today. Yeah, we are. You know, it really does take an army of volunteers to make this happen. This is remote area medical, and they set up these pop-up clinics all over the country. They do about two per month. Right now, we're sort of in their dental clinic area, but there are other rooms in this high school where they're doing all kinds of health consultations. They're also doing some vision tests, but joining me right now is somebody who volunteered to come down here all the way from Chicago. Dave Maurer, thanks so much for being with us. Why did you decide to come down here to do some of this work today? Well, Remote Area Medical does fantastic work. We offer clinics across the country for our citizens who can't afford to go to a doctor, can't afford access to health care, maybe they can't afford the prescriptions, uh, and it just makes a huge difference to the folks who come to serve. But you work as a nurse in your regular job, and then on your off time, you come here to do this work. Why do you do it? Well, I'm blessed in what I do. I have a wonderful job back home working as a nurse in a correctional facility. Uh, I find it very rewarding to help those who are in need. And uh, we live in the greatest country in the world. When I know our citizens are struggling with health care issues and they need help, and I can make a difference in their life, I find it important to come and provide that difference wherever possible. What have you seen here today? I've seen a lot of folks come in who are struggling with issues with their diabetes. A couple were having problems with uh, dental issues that they're able to get addressed right now, which we're really excited about. We've had a great turnout. They've taken advantage of free pap smears along with uh, free hepatitis C testing. So you have all kinds of medical testing going on here. You know there's a debate going on in D.C. about health care. What do you see when you're down here sort of at this level, at the grassroots level? Well, I'll be honest with you, it's frustrating. Politicians debate about health care, and RAM is down here providing it. I would strongly encourage President Trump and members of Congress to come down here and see firsthand what our fellow citizens are going through. Again, we live in the greatest country in the world, and there's really no need for us to be suffering like this. All right, Dave Maurer, thank you so much for joining us again. Dave came down all the way from Chicago. There are people that have come up from Mississippi, from Atlanta, Georgia, just to volunteer at these clinics. And by the way, even though the name of this RAM has remote in it, they also do these clinics in urban areas. In fact, at the end of the month, they're doing one in Washington, D.C., which just goes to show that the need for accessible health care isn't just a rural issue, but also one that you find in cities. Thomas. Well, the need for people.